Hi, how are you? <clears throat> Good to see you again. It's always a fucking pleasure. I got another mail call. One I mentioned from uh, the other day. Which I said I was going to get it to Chavez, uh, Chavez uh, 929. It's the one I, I, I wanted originally, but I'm glad I got the other one, and I'll explain that later. Not much going on. Typical quiet day out in the fucking woods. What are you going to do? What I'm going to do is I'm going to move the fucking camera and we'll get into this because I don't really have all that much. I ain't got nothing to fucking say. If I did, I'd let you know. Well, here we go. Fucking A. Damn Skippy. Alright, here's the deal. A while back, I don't know, a year ago, I can never keep track of time. I gotta know. Well, you know, I gotta know. I Not that I gotta know, because I already know. But I gotta know. I, this is a no. Do you know? You woke. You woke. He woke. I hate that fucking... He woke. Never mind. So anyway, a long time ago, on the land, land far away, I got a Chavez Redencion uh, street. And I got it, and I like it. It's out of M390, but what I don't like uh, out of any knife is when they take, and I've discussed this before, when they put G10 on one side and a different material on the other side. It could be anything. Uh, it could be a fucking blue denim micarta for all I fucking care. I don't like it. I don't like it because it, it just doesn't uh, look to me like it's it's what it's supposed to be. It's that it's there, you know? It looks half done to me. But, uh, of course, I'm, it's cold out here. Did I tell you? This is a Generation 4 Chavez Redention Street. Closed is 4.25 inches. I like this knife. I really like this knife. I like this knife so much that I'm willing to forgive that it looks like, oh, hey, well, we did this side, but, you know, we ran out of material, so we had to use a different material. Or we started out in G10, but ran out of G10 and had to go with titanium. Or we just wanted to, like, I don't know, it just, it, it, it annoys me. But I like this blade enough not to be annoyed. Now, the blade, speaking of that, is an M390. <laughs> Look at that bad boy. This is not the Tonto version. This is a, uh, I don't know, I can't remember, but it's a compound grind. This is a hollow, this is like a flat. Very nicely done. These motherfuckers are sharp, boy. Overall, we're looking at 7.5 inches. Very nice. I like the skull. I really do, because, I mean, you can tell what, what knife it is just by looking at it. It also comes with a different clip. This one went for, like, $320. Oh, it's a drop point, sorry. Uh, the scales, you can see that. They're G10 and titanium. It is a frame lock, which is nice. I mean, this thing is tough. It's got a little assistance, even though I don't know if they say it does or not, but... I mean, and the, the ergonomics on this thing, the jimping right here is not a little woosy jimping. This is man jimping. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. What's the number for 911? <laughs> anyway, maybe I should call 411 to get the number for 911. Wouldn't that be some shit? Hey, for, hey, information, what is the number for 911? Do you have an emergency, sir? Well, no, not really, but, you know, well, because he's already dead. Uh, I just need to come pick up the body. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I thought I didn't have anything to fucking say, which I don't. 
Uh, Generation 4 Chavez overall, uh, I mean, the ergonomics and the jimping and the little choil right here, and sure, it takes up some of the cutting edge, but that's okay. I mean, this thing is sweet. I mean, it's just like, it's sweet. And for the longest time, I wanted the other one. I wanted a 929. Couldn't find one. Couldn't find one anywhere. Maybe it's because they're just sold out. It's like everything else is fucking sold out. But I got one. Yes, look at that pretty box. They all come in a pretty box. This one, it has a sticker right here, and it says CMUMR229RSW Titanium SKU. But in a barcode, but underneath it, it's, it's over another sticker, and I tried to find out what's underneath that sticker, and it's another barcode. I don't know. I couldn't, couldn't figure out what was underneath that one, and I don't guess it really fucking matters, but it, it, it did. It did to me. You got another little sticker right here, and I can't make out what it is. That's okay. Check this out. When I open this up, I never really paid attention to the size difference, but the size difference is important. And I will show you why in a minute. Let me get my notes. I need notes. You know why I need notes? Because I forget things. I'm telling you that because I just wanted you to know it's just something that happens. It does. It's okay. We forget things. Chavez Redention 229. Oh. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. This thing is sweet. I mean, look at that baby. Look at that baby. It's a baby. It's not a baby, this motherfucker. And it's titanium. And it went for $375. You're looking at it, it meant for titanium knives. And this thing ha is up to par with the same quality of this that. You're looking at med for titanium knives are going for like eight, nine hundred dollars right now, I should know because I bought a few of them. This thing is sweet. Comes with an extra clip if you want to change the clip out. Let's see if I can get it out. Here's the extra clip. Where you can change it out where it doesn't look so... Oh my gosh! He's got a knife with a fucking skull on it! We better run! We wouldn't want that, would we? So anyway... I mean, it is sweet, and I didn't realize that how much bigger this is. Close, this is 4.6. Remember the other stats, because I'm not going to go over them again. The blade is 3... For, watch this. Look at that. This one is a Tonto. Yes, compound grind, hollow here. This thing is sweet. You know, I saw a scab do his, and he says it's a beast. You don't really know it's a beast until you get it in your fucking hand, and then you're like, wow, this is really a fucking beast. I like this. Yes, this thing feels great. It fills up all the hand and leaves a little bit left over. Nice thumb stud on both sides. Got the got the logo for the Chavez, the key, the skull, the key to the city. Well done, well put together. I mean, just sweet frame lock, and of course, both of them have the override where it doesn't, you know, like whatever you want to call that. Overall, this is eight point two five. It's M390, it's a frame lock, and that's what I said. Check this out. Let's do it again. Is that pretty or what? Look at that fucking blade, boys and girls. I mean, it's got man jimping, too. That thing is, boy, I'll tell you what, I love this knife. I really do. I mean, I love both of them, but this thing is, I mean, and check them out together. Look at that. Now you can see the size difference in the two between the street and the, I believe they call this the Ultimar. But is that pretty or what? I mean, uh, cheapers. And here's the difference between the drop point and the Tonto. Uh, I am blown away, boys and girls. 
I am like totally blown away with this. This is just, I don't know what else to say. I mean, look at the quality and the deed. This thing is just sweet. This thing, I mean, it's just, it's just sweet and then some. I mean, look at the finish on the blade, catching it in the light. <sighs> Jeepers. That's what I was telling you. This one is just as sweet and I was able to forgive the G10. It's okay. I give both of these a yes. I would have. Not just a yes, but a hell fucking yes. Yeah, a fucking A team yes. Boy, I mean, I. Jeepers, man. I mean, look at that. Let the pictures tell the story. I mean, that is just. Oh, my gosh. Both made in China. Okay. Okay, but <laughs> whoever those Chinese people are that made it, man, I'll tell you what. And what's in my pocket? I got this little, uh, I got this little Main Street right here. I got a bigger Main Street, both at Warncliffe. That's what's in my pocket today. And in my little watch pocket. No, I don't have an ink pen. But I got an ink pen. Ugh. In my wash pocket, I can't remember what this one is. Oh, it's a Kershaw. Yeah, it's a little tiny Kershaw. And it, it's a sweet little blade. I'm getting like kind of used to blades that are like really small and it's just so much. I, I bought a buck. I got the mini auto. I can't remember deliverance, deployment, something like that. That should be here in a few days. And I was bored. And when I get bored, I buy fucking knives. Keeps me off the rooftop with a high powered rifle. But that's not the point. Here's the size of an ink pen. In case you have an ink pen, you want to know what it compares it to. Boys, girls, I have seven minutes of battery left and I can I can talk for seven minutes. These things are just sweet. I mean, it's just like, this titanium is just silky sweet. This frame lock is silky, silky yeah, mm hmm Man, I'll tell you what. And the, the, the lockup's about a half inch. No wobble, centering, centering. Are we centered? Yeah, we're centered. We got our center. Both of them have their center. I mean, Chavez, kick-ass knives. I mean, Jesus, I should have went, Jesus, I should have went with this one sooner. I should have, but I didn't, and it wasn't there, so I didn't get it, and now it's here. Yes. Got a nice little squedge right here. Beautiful. Beautiful. Really beautiful. On both sides, it has a star bit. It looks like T6. It has a star bit to get the, the little thing out. All of them look like a Look at the finish on that, man. I mean, jeez. Okay, I could I could be going, you know, forever, you know, geez, geez, wow, you know, golly jeepers, you know, hey, look at that, and this is like really, yeah, mm -hmm. This one I've used a little bit, and it holds an edge. This M390 does really well. Yeah. <sighs> Gives me a woody. Get one, get two. I put a link to Scav's video down below. I'm blown away. This thing, uh, did I tell you the weight difference? This one is like, um, what is it? This one is 6.56 ounces, 4.4 ounces. 
so you can tell the difference in the beef. This has the beef. Uh, gotta go. Very busy. Thanks for joining me. It's always a fucking pleasure. See you in a few days. If I don't see you and you see me and I don't see you first, then I can see you.